Okay, good morning. Here we are at one of our patisserie display fridges uh, at Westfield White City. I just want to go through a few of the things that have caused the fridge to overheat. Um, so there are two removable panels which you can see I've removed and they're easily removed by removing the screws at point A and point B there and then the two panels come off and they expose this area. Now this area obviously gets very dirty from all the cake debris it should be regularly cleaned. Now here we have the condenser and then behind the condenser we have the fan and what we can actually see here is that the fan is sitting in water so this here is ice so there's a large block of ice which is built up here and what that ice is doing is stopping the fan turning around it's slowing the fan down as it's trying to turn the water uh, and what that means is that the cold air isn't circulating around the fridge and therefore the fridge isn't functioning as it should the key here then is that the drain is blocked by the ice which isn't allowing the water to drain as it should and evaporate out the fridge. There's also an electrical safety risk as the fan gets water inside it could cause electric shock or damage and could cause the fridge to uh, become faulty. So key really here is to turn the fridge off at regular intervals on quiet evenings over a period of 8 to 10 hours. That will allow the ice to disintegrate, that will allow you to unblock the drain if it has become blocked by any dirt or debris or for the water to flow through the drain if it's not frozen and allow you to get back to normal. So if you do have a polar display fridge that is causing issues, that's likely to be your cause. Um, I'll give this a clean up now and uh, let the ice disintegrate a little bit and should get back to normal. Thanks.